Welcome back for another Fetch AI Prize Prediction Analysis and allow me to start the video by first sharing my long-term Ethiopian analysis here on the charts where you can see that after seeing our bear market low back in 2022 at around the $0.025 mark we saw that impulsive move to the upside where we picked in these five we've moved to the upper side in a move that completed the formation of these larger area to have count one and after seeing the formation of that first wave to the upper side we started a corrective structure in the formation of this wave two where we have been seeing no prices in this abc corrective structure into the target area for the second wave which is an area that i came up with using the fibonacci's connecting them from the low of the first wave to the high of that wave one giving me a minimum retracement area between the fib level 0.5 and the fib level 0.78 and that was between the 0.3313 dollar mark and the 0.17 dollar mark which is an area that we have now fully maximized and also continued to hold within the target area suggesting that fetch ai might have given us the low for the second wave and in the next coming weeks we can see a reaction of the target area and start gearing up impulsively in the formation of this wave 3 and in the formation of that wave 3 we also expect to see a five wave structure in formation to confirm to us that we have a low in place for the second wave and we are now getting impulsive in the formation of that wave 3 and zooming in on the charts you can see that i have this edit wave structure on the charts where I'm terming this move after seeing our lows on the 17th of August in a move that gave us a high at around the $0.2746 mark as the formation of that we won. And there are high chances that whatever we are seeing at the moment is a corrective structure in the formation of this wave 2 into the minimum retracement area for the second wave highlighted on the charts using this blue target area which is an area that I came up with by connecting the Fibonacci from the low of the first wave to the high of that wave one, getting my minimum target area for the second wave between the Fib level 0 0.5 and the Fib level 0 0.618. And that is between the $0.218 mark and the $0.2047 mark. And it is within this blue target area that we can expect fetch ai to give us the low for the second wave before we can get impulsive once more in the formation of this wave three and in case we continue seeing further weakness fully maximizing the target area and maybe at some point we lose the fib level 0 0.618 i will be expecting fetch ai to give us one more new low on the fib level 0 0.78 and that is at around the 0 0.1856 dollar mark before we can get that massive bounce to the upper side in the formation of that wave 3 so that is what i'm keeping my eyes on on the short term and also on the long term here on the fetch ai chart so let's be patient and see how that plays out and i will be keeping you up to date 